morning in the name of Jesus and today um, Bay is not here so I might as well have to be the one to shoot this video acting somehow as if I'm on a selfie but nonetheless um, let us get on what we do and who we are yeah um, I did upload a video um, the video I felt that somehow it's not quite um, the quality I want so the video will be coming right up here again with an even clearer like HD format so expect that video and actually I wanted to communicate and say but this one thing sometimes um, this is what happens even in a shrine where by the name of Jesus is called it can happen that when the name of Jesus is called, what happen, What really happens is that demons can manifest, demons can flee, demons can do all that they do because the, the name of Jesus has been called upon, even in a shrine. So there's a video that is coming right up about like, um, it's one herbalist, um, I don't know what you call them from your area, one herbalist, Sangoma, I don't know what you call them but it's one herbalist saving the kingdom of darkness but yeah they have the bible by their side but they, the source of their healing the source of their blessings is the devil they might not know it they may know it but it's the devil they are saving the father of lies so the, the source of what they do the source of what they have been assigned to do is the devil. Remember that the devil kills, steals, and destroys. That is but his mandate. He's the unrepentant soul. But the human being, they can repent. And I need to, ca to caution our, f our fellow believers. Not, uh, let me not say fellow believers. But I need to, ca to caution those who are hungry for Christ. Those who want to be truly, really born again. Stop praying evil, wicked prayers. Back to sender prayers. They don't reflect in anyhow in them. I, I, I know your man of God, your woman of God might have um, told you that you need to pray them, you need to kill your enemies. But they're not, biblically wise, they're not, they're inappropriate. So stop killing. Because you never know the same enemy you kill today is the same enemy who will help you in God's calendar of events that person is your destiny helper but you are killing them remember Christianity is not about it's not about flesh and blood flesh and blood does not inherit the kingdom of God but what you fight is the spirit not the person not the physical person but what you fight is the spirit inside the person sometimes so, uh, most of the time some people souls they are stolen even from birth so they'll be saving the devil not because it, right in their conscience they chose to but because they've been initiated some they grow from families that serve the devil so they choose to do that thing but um you need not pray evil prayers because my friend you'll be surprised one of the days when you find yourself in hell in hell just for the bible said love your neighbor as you love yourself pray for your neighbor as you pray for yourself two wrongs does not make you cry no matter how right or wrong you are no matter how right, how right or wrong you are do not hold offense and because you are right it doesn't in any way tell you to do bad to others so this, this evil wicked prayers of back to sender that you have been praying, that is why people do not want to repent. They don't want Christ because they have been given this Christianity. They've been given this Christianity um, overview, which is a wrong emphasis and analysis, and analysis of Christianity. Christianity is not a, uh, it's not a religion, but rather Christianity is it's a relationship a real walk with Christ Jesus. That's Christianity. Christ Jesus came to this earth to save, to save you when you did not even deserve it. He came for you. 
he did not kill you in in your sinful life he did not kill you but rather he chose to come to earth to save you so why should you kill others you are saved to save others that you must remember and you must recall you are saved to save others so if you are going to be killing people and killing people and you being the righteous one all this anointed too much anointed prayers hey my brother my sister they don't work well. they don't work you are you are telling me that your papa your mama they pray they pray like prayers that are dangerous, dangerous prayers at 3 a.m., dangerous prayers at 1 a.m. Stop killing your enemies. The enemies, if the Bible says that the Lord prepareth a table right before your enemies, it means that you need your enemies. You, sometimes you need oppo opposition to get right to where you should be going. So if you are without enemies, if you are not opposed, you will not amount to the very individual you have been made to be by God. So I'm sorry for today's video. It's as if like it's a selfie because uh, she's not here. So no, uh, most of the time she's the one taking videos. But the Lord is gracious. It is well. It is well. It is well. It is well. In Jesus Christ. I love you, but Jesus Christ loves you the more. Jesus Christ loves you the more. If ever in this world there is anything you need to get, it's salvation for your soul. Forget about the miracles, forget about the prophecies, forget about Seek ye first the kingdom of Jesus and all his righteousness, and then everything else shall be added unto you. You need when you are living, because your life is brought of Jesus, you need salvation for your soul. You need to repent, you need to come back return to your creator you need jesus and that money you are crying for you need jesus because when you have jesus what you are in lack of he has it all you will have it because if you don't have jesus but you keep getting what is from him you will not maintain it the right way there is how you get a blessing from God and you maintain the same blessing you got from him. Because if you are without Jesus, you get even the devil's blessings. And you 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 will not even you will not even really know that it is the devil's blessings. But you say that God has blessed you, yet it is the devil. So get Jesus in your life and watch your life change. Get Jesus in your life, not because you are running away from the devil, but you, because you acknowledge him as your Lord, Savior, and Redeemer of your life. He is coming, and all eyes are going to see him. Get him for the salvation of your soul. Get him for your people to be saved. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, his will about your life shall be done in your life. Let the will of my Father, my Master, Jesus Christ, be done in your life. Thank him, thank him, thank him, and bless him, him and him alone, because he is worthy, he is God. Thank you, Spirit of the living God.